Hello and welcome viewers and subscribers of AVG News. Olisi Nube is my name and I am here just to give you an update on what is actually refreshing news uh, following the tragedy that we reported on. That was last week. You would know that on Sunday, South Africa was uh, thrown into deep mourning after uh, some criminals during a hijacking uh, attempt shot and killed a boy who is five years was five years old Titeboho Palani Jr. Uh, and we shared especially on our social media angles as well that this tragedy has befallen the country now the good news not so good but refreshing is that two of the suspects have been arrested in connection with the armed robbery and murder of the boy and police have just confirmed that they have been arrested we hope that these two will be held to court where they are going to pay for their crime and if there are any others that are remaining it is a sincere hope and prayer that they will also be arrested and made to pay for their crime uh, it is so sad that a boy of that age has had his life taken away from him by people who don't want to work by people who want to reap where they did not sow uh, will leave you listening to a video or watching a video from a police spokesperson about the arrest don't forget to subscribe to this channel like this video and share it after you watch. With this case in Soshangube, where a five-year-old was shot and fatally wounded, we have worked uh, tirelessly day and night. And uh, as for now, we had a breakthrough. Uh, the investigation has led the team to specific addresses in Soshangube, where upon we arrested two suspects in different locations. In uh, one of the locations in the house, the suspect was found in possession of an licensed firearm. In the other location, we also found the suspect not too far from the crime scene or proximity to the crime scene where we arrested also the second suspect in possession of unlicensed firearm. And in this case, this firearm is linked to a car hijacking which was committed during 2023 in Akashia, whereupon uh, there was also a firearm in that particular case. We also move to the third location. <clears throat> the third, third location where it is believed that the other suspect who is not arrested based on the leads of information, uh, as we pounce in that house, we could not find the suspect, but we have found or we found the vehicle, this vehicle, it is reported stolen in Mabopani, and this vehicle, it is the vehicle based on information which is linked uh, to the commission of the crime where the five-year-old was fatally wounded. And as I'm saying, the vehicle itself is reported stolen,